Good evening and welcome back once again. As you can see, we're away to Almeria today. This is the last game before the transfer window closes. But look at this. If you didn't see the last match, we managed to get Messi in as a regen. We're going to start on this match, first of all, on the right wing. I wasn't sure about starting them, but if you look down here, Martin Elias on a downward red. So we thought we'll switch the RB over to the left. And we'll put Messi on the right. It's probably his favourite position, that right wing position. We are keeping Vieira in because he hasn't played in the last couple of matches due to downward form. Although we could have started the likes of Kusan, so Kang and Lee. Xerxes on and up, but Castro is too. No doubt he'll probably come on for a little bit of game time. But let's see how the new boy Messi gets on. And there's been goals galore in the past couple of matches. It was 5-2 against Atletico Madrid. Then the last match it was... God, I can't remember what it was now, was it? 6-0? Um, I can't remember how it finished. I think it was 6. One thing I'm not sure about is how to train Messi. What, what sort of role I want to train him in. Because... Depending what role you pick, it, it changes what stats are increased. Um, I think all stats increase over time anyway, but some quicker than others. He's currently naturally down as a creative playmaker, but um, there are certain stats that don't go up very quickly. And there's some of the stats that he's a little bit poor in at the moment, likes of finishing, things like that. So I'm going to have a play around and see what I want to sort of train him in, but we'll worry about that later down the line. Let's see how he gets on today. I'm, I mean, I'm not expecting to be spectacular straight away because, yes, it's messy, but he is a regen, remember? So, first touch the ball anyway. That was a poor pass from Vieira, I think it was. Ooh, nanny. Yeah, it was one of those games where there were, there were a few players that I wasn't sure who to play, just because it's not a bad thing, but just people are on up. Um, it's a good uh, position to be in. Nice touch from Messi there, showing us class already. Here's Gedson. Vieira. Messi, that was a bit of a poor pass from Vieira, to be fair. Ooh, Vieira now. Gedson. Oh, blocked DRB that's a poor pass wasn't really a lot of options DRB oh what a finish with his weaker foot how about this for a finish here Castro level one touch and just without hesitation curled it on the keeper. I'm actually not sure what his stats are on his weaker foot, but uh, it must be pretty good. Nice early goal, that's what we want. If you can get a goal in the first 20 minutes, it just makes such a difference to the rest of the match. Not as much pressure on. Good tackle from Emerson there. Nice little play there. Oh, yeah, we just couldn't get the power in the header. Already, Messi is looking quality though, isn't he? Just some of the little touches and passes he's played. Uh, kind of what you expect I suppose but good tackle there double oh, that was a terrible why are you trying to pass over your back to to play there especially in that position that's not a good ball either yeah tech share is definitely one I, I think I just need to get rid of to be honest he's just not keeping up with the Still always be remembered for that magnificent goal he scored, which I still think is one of the best goals I've ever scored in a football game. For my me personally, anyway, it was one of the most enjoyable. Oh, a nice play to Messi. And well, I played it to the area, and then all of a sudden it switched play. Oh, that wasn't a bad pass. It does that sometimes this game. Now 
And Messi again. Nice play, Emerson. That's a foul and it's a penalty. I think the referee tried to play on, rightly so. But it came to nothing straight away. Clear foul. And it's Vieira with the chance to put us 2-0 ahead. And saved. Again, if the keeper goes the right way, they, they just save it. It's just the way it is in this game. It's very predictable. Nice play by Messi. Gets in. Oh, just wide. Disappointed. Would have liked Vieira to get a goal. He's missed a couple of matches. Like I say, it's re it genuinely is down to luck. And obviously, if you take a terrible penalty and miss, fair enough. But, yeah, Messi hasn't got the pace that he would have had genuinely when he was this age. But uh, that's one thing we'll have to improve. Fiera gets in. Diaby. Oh, what a finish again. Diaby's having a storming game today. His favourite position is on that left wing. Um, and I've said it before, I'd just like to play him on the right wing because he's left footed and I like to cut inside. But his uh, weak foot stats, I need to check them because they must be very good. That's two finishes with his right foot today. Clinical. And there's been no hesitation with both the finishes he's had. He's, he's taken, you know, the first goal he took one touch and just slammed it in from, what, 20 yards. That was very similar. Nice play from Messi again. And Emerson's, he's having a good game today. Oh. Oh, I'm there. Did the keeper save it? I actually don't know what happened. <laughs> I thought it was in. Let's have a look at this again. Oh, he hit it over. I, I don't know why I thought that was in. Or that I clipped the ball. The keeper saved it. He just headed it over. That's a terrible header. Right in front of goal. Nice play there. Now Messi. Vieira. Messi. Castro. Really nice play all round there. Just a shame it didn't end in the goal. Gets in. Castro. Diaby. Castro. Gets in. Oh, how's he hit it wide? Again, great play. Really good passing. And that is when our team at its best. When it's playing that flowing one-touch quick passes... You know, not dawdling on the ball or trying to overplay it too much. Oh, Messi's nearly in there. <laughs> Maybe one last chance before the half ends. Vieira. Ugh, don't know what Vieira's doing there, but it's 2 0. Two cracking strikes from Diaby. Diaby's clearly massive front runner for man of the match, but there's been some great performances. Emerson's been very good. Gedson, Messi's been fantastic. Castro's played well. Bit of a poor pass from Messi there. Nearly came off, but not quite. Castro again. Messi, great play there, Vieira. And that is the goal and an assist for Messi. And it's good to see the captain back on the score sheet. Again, just those flowing moves. Castro into Messi, one touch into Vieira's path and just in the inside of the post. Crack 
can finish again. And I'm glad Messi's got an assist because he, he deserves it. He's been very good today. And I haven't been trying to force it, you know, because he's the new guy trying to get him a goal and stuff. I've just been playing naturally and he's just... It, he looks very, very sharp. He's not quick yet. This is uh, speed. What's that? Offside. His speed stats are, are fairly low. Um, I think his acceleration's fairly high. Um, so his initial burst. We just yeah, he looks very sharp. The little passes he's playing. Oh, that's poor from Vieira. Vieira hasn't had the best game. I know he scored. Um, and he's he's played some nice stuff. But he just hasn't. Well, yeah, he hasn't. He hasn't looked too sharp. I would say. He hasn't played for a couple of games though, so maybe that's why. Castro into Gedson. Giabi. Castro, that's a poor pass though. Castro. Great turn and finish. His speciality. And it's 4 0 now. Fierro with an assist. But it's that little initial turn and burst and then just slots it away. He's so good at that with his back to goal. Look, defender stands no chance there. He's just he's lost them there. We'll make some subs now. So we're gonna make some changes. Cousin's coming in for Vieira. He's gonna to switch to centre midfield position. Messi's gonna come off for Kang and Lee, and Mudrik is gonna come on for Diaby. Didn't really want to bring uh, <laughs> these guys off, but I want to get the subs on and without tinkering with the formation too much, they're the sort of natural placements. Diaby, surely man of the match. Messi should get a very good rating. Vieira hasn't been his best game, but he's got a goal. He's got an assist. He missed the penalty, while well, it was saved. Um, yeah, they've done the job. And Lee Kang in playing, sorry, Kang and Lee, I think it is. Um, playing in that sort of wide role, which he doesn't only play, he's played in once or twice. He normally likes to play in that position that Kusons has come in. Nice play from him. Castro. That's a corner though. Of course, Kusons will take over. Corner duties is very good at set pieces normally. Oh, I thought that was in. Great corner. Just couldn't bend his neck to get it on target. there from Castro just a bit too soft needs some pace in it oh Castro's in here though and there it is it's five Mudrick with the assist this time at this rate Castro might get him out of the match it's a nice header forward Mudrick a simple ball in and Castro's has just got acres of space and he does what he does best there Yeah, it's probably going to be a toss-up between Castro and Diaby now for man of the match. And this time yet, I mean, if Castro scores another one, it's almost certainly going to be him. But for Diaby, just for those two strikes that really set the game off and running, obviously it's done and dusted now. Um, but he really set the game alight. He scored when it really mattered. And two great strikes as well. They weren't tap-ins at all. 
he's Kangen Lee. Oh, and he gets absolutely shoved off the ball. How is that not a free kick? I don't know. I've said it before, but if I do that to one of their players, it will be a free kick. Um, it's just annoying. Yep, and that's a free kick. Nicely cleared there. Cousins with a bit of time on the ball here. Uh, Mudrick, you stopped your run. Why did you stop your run there? Had acres of space. He was nowhere near being offside. That's a poor header. Good tackle though from Kosinu. Nice ball into Mudrick. And a simple finish. A great finish. Castro with an assist now. I think Castro might get man of the match. Nice little ball there. A tidy finish. I hope Messi gets a good rating because you know some sometimes players have really good games and they just don't get a good rating. It's a it's a really weird system that they, Konami have just never tried to improve and I I don't get it. I really don't. It's been the same for absolute years and they haven't changed that rating system to really reflect what <laughs> what it is. It's very very simplified. You know, if your player scores, they get a good rating, even if they've had a terrible game otherwise. Um, goalkeepers, defenders t tend to get really bad ratings just because they haven't been involved massively, but they've not conceded a goal and played pretty decently. It's a, yeah, it's, it's a very simplistic view of ratings, and it really doesn't work a lot of the time. Nice play there. Cousins. Now Lee Kang in. Not much space to work with. Gedson. Oh, good save. It was dipping. I think that was going just under the bar. If the keeper didn't save it. Right. One last chance here, maybe. Come get this ball in. Herrera. Good save. And that is full time. Brilliant performance. And indeed, Ruben Castro does get man of the match. I think that's about right. See, Cousins, can he, I don't think they did anything wrong when they came on. I thought they played pretty well. So that's a bit strange. Texera getting a four. I agree. He gives the ball away a couple of times. Messi getting a seven. Very happy with that. But that's it for today, guys. Next match will be on the 1st of February. And we'll see if there's been any incomings or outgoings in that match. I'll update you in the next video. I don't think there's going to be too much action. So join us for that one. Hit that like button. Drop a comment down below. And subscribe to the channel if you're not already. And I'll see you then. Cheers.